Before I start the evening, I have something to tell you. This isn't the Terry Evans show. This is your evening. It's spirit evening. I've just got the problem or the job of linking the two dimensions. And in all the years I've been working, I've never been able to decide who's coming through and what they're going to say. Even as I stand before you now, I still don't know. Who would like to come up and help me? They don't want it. When I'm working, I will either come directly to you, depending on how the radar is working. I never know how they're going to contact. Uh, sometimes they will call out a name and point into the direction where that person is sitting. And sometimes I hear the spirit name and they point to the direction where they want me to go. Interesting, isn't it? Interesting, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> um, but it always amuses us up here as we, we watch you. Especially if I come direct to one of you. And we hear these words. Oh, the come to me. <laughs> so it, it can be, it can be a little bit of, it can be a little bit emotional, it can be a little bit of nerve wracking at times. It can be the sense of sound, but it can be the nerve wracking. By the way, how long have you been here for the first time for something like this? How long have you had not to have the first time? Oh, you can get in, you can get in, but you can't get out. <laughs> you two are going to behave. They told me that the two travel majors were sitting in the back. <laughs> anyway, one other question I would like to ask. I oh, I've forgotten something. When I come to you, as I'm giving you the information, should you recognize it? Just say yes. If you don't work and recognize it, just say I don't recognize it. Okay. But I do not want information from you. I'd much rather make a mistake. For sure, they might. Okay. Oh, one other thing. Even though the work I do on behalf of Spirit this evening is sacred for them and hopefully for you, and some of the ghosts I work with, <laughs> they have a sense of humor. And they're asking permission tonight whether they can use that humor sometimes as they're coming through. <laughs> so I have to ask you, is it okay? Are you okay? And you don't know what you've done. <laughs> I've been taking everything. <coughs> Where am I going? So The lady with the glasses on. Don't have any 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 well, I'm glad about that. You just said it to your father. Thank you. I saw the season there. I'm having a car. So, they've taken my good time. You can hear that it was one of the things that was going to be 
Ja, ja, ja. 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 Ja, ja, I see a good man, but I, I, he gives me, he's just talking to me with feelings at the moment, but he would have been a serious man. Because you, are, you need to hear your sexy voice, because no one else can hear it. <laughs> and he tells me that before he went, his health was failing and it wasn't good. Han berättar att innan han gick över så var hans hälsa dålig. Han var inte bra. Mm, nej. Well, then I have two people here. Då har jag två personer med mig här. Would you also recognize, I'm not sure if it's mamma, but one, like a mamma on the other side too. Jag är inte säker på att det här är mamma, men kan du känna gärna att det finns någon som var som en mamma på andra sidan? Mamma, finns mamma sidan? Okej, vad var det? Då har jag båda här. Och jag tror att det är mamma som berättar att hon skulle vara ganska allvarlig i dag. Jag ger dig bara information. Mm. I've been trying to get through to you for a long time. De har försökt nå dig länge. They want to thank you for all that you did for them after they passed and before. For sure. Mm -hmm. And they were so happy with the way you organized the grounding. For sure. Yeah. It is perfect. But then they've got to say this to you. Papa tells me that he was always, you've always been a thinker, you've always been thinking a lot about spirit, you've been thinking a lot about people, you've always had people as a concern. As your papa's now, he seems to step forward and take him over, but I get him, he was an intelligent man, he was a clear-minded man. And he's telling me just now, he's saying, I'm smarter than you, Gary. <laughs> it's a joke. Because what your papa's doing now, have you beginning to relax? He's beginning to show the humor. Mm -hmm. He had kind of, one would describe it as being a dry humor. Mm -hmm. I get the feeling that he didn't like it when he was one time and he didn't have a mess, okay? Okay, well he just comes here to take that breath. So they both come and let you know to lift you up. Well, they'll come and start lifting you up. They tell me that you need it. So they come to send you their love. So they come to send you their love. And you know, it's a pity because the kind of lady you are, the kind of person you are, you know, there's feeling right through your body, there's feeling in your bones. For sure. Mm -hmm. And that's what you've been doing for And it's a little bit of a surprise because there's a lot of people on the other side 
you have had that wish to say thank you to you. Så har du en överraskning också, för det finns många människor på andra sidan som nu har hjälpt som vill tacka dig. Because you don't know how much peace you have given to people before they left your care in peace. Du vet inte hur mycket frid du har gett människor innan de lämnade av din omvårdnad i fulla. And they want you to keep talking to them. They want you to keep talking to them. De vill att du ska fortsätta prata med dem. Prata med andra av dem. Du har redan pratat med dem. Every time you think about them. Varje gång du tänker på dem. Often when you're sitting alone at home, you feel them around. För ofta när du sitter ensam hemma så känner du deras närvaro. You know what they call you? You know what they call you? Det är vad de kallar dig. The silent hero. The silent hero. Yeah. Den stillsamma tysta hjälten. So this is a big conference in this group. Så här är en stor erkännande som andra har. And you know what mama says when she's laughing? Det är vad mama säger när hon skrattar. You're going to live to be even more or even older and more difficult. Du kommer att leva tills du blir ännu äldre och ännu mer besvärlig. And um, they don't want you in the spirit of the earth. Because the way God wants you doesn't need you. You have already got an end share. Did you understand the joke? Mama and Papa just want to tell you that happened. Mamma och pappa vill bara ta dem för det här som är viktiga. Och så tror jag att det kommer till att du ska vara De kommer också med det här budskapet för de vill tala om för dig att du inte ska oroa dig för din hälsa. Du kommer att vara i god kondition när du är 99. Du kommer att vara i god kondition när du är 99. Mamma och pappa vill bara ta dem för det här. Mamma och pappa ville bara komma igenom och hälsa. Och med en av dem, och jag tror att det kunde vara mamma, hon tror att hon vill ha musik, för jag tror att det kan vara mamma, för jag har hört musik. Ja, det är bra. Och hon har precis varit på kamp, längre har fått nya lösthänder. Förstår du? The one she had, every time she tried to sing, the, the false teeth dropped, so she had to go to the dentist. And she laughs. She just wants, they both want to tell you they're fine. And remember, and remember what the spirit world said. There's many people over there that want to thank you for your kindness. Och kom ihåg vad andra världen sa, att det finns många där på andra sidan som vill tacka dig för din värdighet och din hjälp. Och din pappa laughs. Sen skrattar din pappa. When you came here tonight. När han kom hit ikväll. Put on his best clothes. Då tog han på sig finkläderna. He wanted to look good. Han ville se bra ut. Det tror du. Nej. Finn, jag får se honom. Han skrattar. Han skrattar. Han skrattar. Han skrattar. Who could have believed that I would go to a store's house? And he's here. For sure. Who could have believed? And so what he wants to say to you is, you know, yeah, I'll try to keep my promise. There is one up after that. Det han försöker säga till dig är, ja jag har försökt hålla mitt löfte, det är inget vi har förlöjt. Det är mamma och pappa till dig. Sen gör både mamma och pappa till dig. One second. The love from mamma och pappa. Med kärlek från mamma och pappa. Tack så mycket. Men säg det. Hej, hur är du?
is around you most of the time. Men hon har kommit för att låta dig få veta att hon finns i din närhet för det mesta. Because she tells me of late that there have been times when you need to help too. Men hon berättar att på sistone har det funnits stunder då du också har behövt hjälp. Yeah. Because she's heard you talking to her. Hon har hört när du har pratat med henne. Because yeah. I mean, when she does those conversations and so what do you think I should do about this? And what's going to happen there? Or to you think, or whatever, in that kind of direction. So she knows everything about your love life. Hon vet allt om ditt kärlek. Allt. Well, we don't want to know the details, but anyway. She wants to know the details, but anyway. So she wants you to know that she's fine. Hon vill bara att du ska veta att hon har det bra. She wants you to tell the family that she's fine. Och hon vill att du ska berätta för familjen att hon har det bra. Tack. Tell them thank you for this major. Tacka dem för allt som du gjorde. And when she tells me, her favorite time is the summer. Sen berättar hon att hennes favoritårstid är sommaren. When the flowers are growing. När blommorna växer. And everything is coming alive. Och allt kommer till liv. She loved to be in the garden. She loved to be surrounded by Hon älskade att vara ute i trädgården och vara omgiven av sådana vackra saker. Och jag ska berätta på det att hon nu befinner sig så har hon den vackraste trädgården man kan tänka sig. Hon tycker fortfarande inte om din musik. Hon var en av livets personligheter. Sen skrattar hon. I love you then and I love you now. Jag älskade dig då och jag gör det fortfarande. Du kommer aldrig vara ensam. So she's going to tell you this. Hon ska säga det här till dig. It's time to put your life together. Det är dags att du får ordning på ditt liv. Don't make any excuses. Sluta komma med ursäkter. Yeah. And go out and see the world. Gå ut och se världen. Det finns en ny början för dig. Hon har iakttagit allt som har hänt. Och hennes ord till dig är de här. Hon vill inte längre höra dig säga, vad gjorde jag för fel? Och ut i världen och vara en vild kvinna. Hon tror att Finn åker till Australien eller New York och skickar ett visbord till mig. Du har en vild, en fri kärn. Så jag tänker att du har en vild kärn. Så jag tänker att du har en vild kärn. Så jag tänker att du har en vild kärn. Hon har tänkt komma hem till dig på lördag förresten. För att hjälpa dig städa. Det är så att hon har försökt besöka dig, men saker och ting är i vägen hela tiden. Hon skrattar. Hon vill bara säga att det är dags för dig att torka tårarna. Jag finns där med dig. Och se fram emot framtiden inte bara. Och om du vill möta en sexig man. Don't ask her. 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 And I don't know what this means, but she tells me on the day she passed, the time was around quarter past twelve, that something happened with her past. She Thank you for the journey to get these flowers. Yeah, but we need a long term enough to have the blue one out.
people, I, I had to now say to you, you're elsewhere from off me. Han säger, nu när jag står här inför alla människor så kan jag äntligen säga att jag älskar dig, förlåt mig. Because he tells me that when you passed over between you and him and members of the family, it was unfinished business. För han berättar att det fanns oklara besaker mellan dig och honom och andra familjemedlemmar. Så hugg jag absolut. Because he wants to, 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 he talks about the sorrow and he talks about the anguish and he talks about the chaos he left behind. Han pratar om sorgen och ja, lidandet och det kaos som han lämnade efter sig. Så det här är ett budskap till alla. Sen vill han göra ytterligare en konstig sak. Skål! Det är inte så att det är en konstig sak. Han säger så här. But what he actually wants to say to you now, he takes the glass and he wants to tell you he's thrown it away. But now he's going to a party. And he's going to a party. He told us. He said, I love the party. I said, I love the party. Can you understand? Can you understand? Absolutely. And then also too, he doesn't know if you'll remember this, but he talks about a time he was a little bit um, under the weather because of alcohol. Yeah. And he um, fell asleep on the toilet. Yeah. And they couldn't get him out. <laughs> he doesn't do that anymore. <laughs> But he also comes, because he's a believer now, but he comes to say, go and learn to be a healer. Han kommer också nu för att han är troende, men han vill också säga, lär dig vara healer, healing. Förstår du? Ja. Ja, ja. Ja, ja. Jag tror att jag skulle vara gift med dig. Jag skulle ha mig tränad inom två veckor. Du skulle ha mig tränad inom två veckor. <laughs> anyway, but what he does want to say is the activity you felt around you in the house has been him. Okay, so he could be doing his best to get to it. He couldn't, once this guy started talking, you couldn't stop him. Men här mannen började prata så fick man inte tyst på honom. Och sen ska jag inte tala om för dig att han är den snyggaste mannen i stan. Han gör så här. Och jag kunde verkligen röra mig och dansa. But it's very important that you give my apologies and my love to all the family. It's very important that you give my apologies and my love to all the family. One second. This has one more thing to say. There's going to be a baby going to your family. There's going to be a baby going to your family. For sure. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I hope it's not you. I hope it's not you. Yeah. But there will be a baby born to the family. And there will be the proudest grandmother in the world. And like all mamas and all grandmothers. It amazes me. They look at this baby, oh it's so beautiful. And I look at it. <laughs> the eye, the love is in the mother's eyes. And uh, One more time, he said, I'm sorry, you're just going to have to do this much, mate. Start playing the piano again. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Han hör den när han säger det, men jag hoppas han kommer till mig. Jag hoppas att han kommer till mig.
Mama, I want to leave. And I love being with you sometimes. Do you want to know what she does? She doesn't want to scare you, you say. She comes up close to you. <coughs> then you say, it must be my imagination. I can feel something. Then suddenly, you get a picture of her in your mind. Och plötsligt får du en bild av henne i dina tankar. Sure. Okay. Always. And then she comes closer. Sen kommer hon närmare. And she's so happy that you've accepted her when she comes. Och hon är så glad att du tar emot henne när hon kommer. Then she comes closer. Hon kommer ännu närmare. She's got a whisper in your ear. Och hon har en whisper i ditt öra. Sure. Okay. So it's not your imagination, mamma. And then she has something very important to tell you. Because she tells me you're a little secret secretive. Why don't you learn to be a medium, Mama? For sure. Yeah. You'd be a great medium, Mama. You'd be much better than Terry. But can she tell you something else? Will I hear it? Hmm. I wonder if I could go to Terry one day. I wonder if I could go to Terry one day. No, no, no. That would change her. For sure. I would like him to be my sweet. No, he wouldn't come to anyone like me. I would like They think he's good enough. So the Spirit also, also sent your daughter with his message to you tonight to confirm to you that they take it. And you've got to buy a new t- uh, telephone. You want to buy a new telephone? Okay. Your phone? The one you've got at home is not working properly. Then you have a hand up with the telephone. Okay. You saw it? Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Where your daughter is, she's dancing, she's happy. Det är inte så mycket som dansar om jag är glad. Kan du förstå det? Och tänk att dra ut det istället. Det är därför att du tar dina tårar. Mamma, varför har du så många tårar? Mamma, varför har du så många tårar? Tårar? Ja. Du tar att du har den bästa kollektionen i Sverige. Nej, det är därför att du har den finaste samlingen i hela södra Sverige. Så många tårar. Ja, men jag finns i det här hjälpen. Hälsa till familjen. Hälsa till familjen. Och kan du hälsa till pappa också? Ja, jag älskar honom. Tell pappa att jag älskar honom. And tell pappa this. Och säg det här till pappa. That he's still to say, I know he's had problems with the car. Att han ska inte säga, jag vet att han har problem med din. Det tror du. And she loves it when you hear Papa say, Sweet Farm, you have the deal. Oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. So, she's doing fine. Oh, how did that? And thank you for what you wrote and you put inside my car. Oh, thank you for the story of an hour in the sister. She said, I love the heart. She said, I love the heart. You love the middle. I love the middle. She said, Just one other thing to say to you. Only going to say an answer to you. So far, Papa's stop complaining and buy some new pillows. So Papa, Papa, stop the clock and show Papa the new pillows. Sure. Thank you. I never know 
Jag har aldrig någon gång rätt eller fel, så jag faktiskt att man undrar. Men det skulle ju inte vara så att det skulle vara så att man inte 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 skulle vara så att One second. Just make sure some being taken in this direction. Yeah, yeah, of course. The higher order, it is not even there. I understood it. What? Last time. Sixth or seventh. Who recognizes Catherine or Colin? Then Catherine and Catherine and the other side. Catherine, the lady black. And she must have been found by the other side. Okay. Good evening, madam. Good evening. Good evening. You should talk to some boss, I understand. I guess I'm going to have a phone and talk to you. You can speak to me with that voice all night. You know, I'd be asking you out for dinner. You should talk to me with that voice all night. You should talk to me with that voice all night. You should talk to me with that voice all night. Would you understand, Karina, she's either talking about herself or talking about somebody else who passed the cancer? Can you understand? Do you understand? Would you understand? And she tells me you've been looking around your kitchen and you're thinking, I've got to fix this kitchen. Can you understand? Do you have a picture of the thing that must be fixed for the house? Yes. No. No. Stop talking to me, baby. It's not good to me. I'm trying to concentrate on my job. Jag försöker koncentrera mig på jobbet nu. Jag är inte så bra med det. And um, would you also have known another man connected? I'm not sure if they were connected to the family, but a young man who passed. He would have been 18, 19 years old. This man is somehow connected to you because he wants to give you a message to pass on to his mother. Men den här mannen har någon slags kopplingsmedel, för han vill ge ett budskap som du kan förmedla till hans mamma. Han har ju fått en tid och lyckas. Han har ju fått en tid och lyckas. Förstår du inte det här? Ställ dig åt sidan just nu då, så kan du ha någon annan. The person who has a part of cancer wants to be remembered to you. Personen som är fått i cancer vill att du ska minnas den personen. Karina wants to be remembered to you. Karina, we love you, Mr. Hannah. And one thing about her when she was in this life, I found was a laughter. Can you understand that? No, it's not the same thing. I'm not saying that I'm having a scratch. Can you tell me about it? No. So she never laughed. I'm not laughing at it. I'm telling you, what's with her? What's with her? You man, check it out, would you? Call her then. But let's go back to you. Now you want to go to bed. Well, this lady here, I can't tell you when she's got a lot of you and she's laughing. One second. No, it is for you, sorry, it is for you. I can't even tell you what's going on. I have a lot of humor and I'm scratching, but this is for you. She's talking about your humor. I'm talking about your humor. Do you understand that? I don't know. She's saying, to a hair or plus. <laughs> she means it in a nice way. She means it in a nice way. She means it in a nice way. She tells me, whenever there's a group of women or people, you're always in the middle of it, having your jokes and having your last words. She means that when there are folks in the group of people, so there's always a mix in the group of people and the last words. And she tells me that when you feast, you do it very frequently. Oh, who would have thought that I had a feast? Miss Lou. She doesn't believe you. You understand? I'm not sure. Yeah. 
Well, she wants to make it a joke with you. Oh, we call it today. When you've got all your friends around you and you're talking about men and all these sorts of things. Keep doing it. Because she's making some money on that. <laughs> she's, she's selling tickets to your special evenings. <laughs> and she loves it when you pretend to be a man. Oh, and that you lost us, lost us for a month. Yeah. <laughs> when you, you, you sort of imitate the actions and the voice of a man. When you have more and more, then so you are here. Yeah. So keep going because they love the show. <laughs> So she got some bad news for you. She wants to talk about this training scheme you want to go on to in the diet. Well, she's been watching you sneak off the refrigerator. Can I show them what you all do? No one's <laughs> and then you say the next morning, I can't understand why I'm not losing weight. <laughs> well, what I, what I would like to do, but I don't think you dare, I'd like you to come up on the scene and show everybody how you walk like Tim Eastman. I I to show you the scene and show you the scene and show you the My reputation is never going to be the same again. But I hate it. I'm sorry, that was your please. I'd show us how you do it. And you can pretend the microphone took up. You can also something to phone and add it. I don't have problems with the spirits, they're okay, they're the people. I don't have problems with the spirits, they're okay, they're the people. Is there an ivory at the back there? There's an ivory. Irene. Irene, I can hear the name Irene. I have a name Irene here. Oh, there you are. Put your hand up. There's a problem. Good evening, Harry. Okay. What's the question? Are you sure? 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 Are you I've got a man here, just standing as I'm standing. And then I hear the name Papa. It's her Papa. Don't make too much fuss about it, but it's her Papa. So I'm saying this. Can you understand this? 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 It's a problem. Don't worry about it. Don't make too much fuss about it. I understand now. 
Det är hennes pappa och hon har inte jag inte så stora farader. Nu förstår jag. I made a mistake. Jag gjorde ett misstag. They're talking about your papa. Hon pratar om din pappa. And I am to tell you from far, far, sorry, it's far, far, I've got you. His papa. But you are not to worry about your papa. Or that he will receive all the help that he needs. And um, he told me that he, he hasn't been so well. And he told me that um, he will be okay, but he will he won't completely regain good health. Sometimes you're going to feel a little bit irritated with him. Ibland kommer du bli lite irriterad på honom. And there's going to be times when you want to put your hands around his neck. Och det kommer att finnas stunder då du vill lägga händerna om halsen på honom. Förstår du det? Ja. And you will want to squeeze for at least 10 minutes. Och du kommer att du lägger hända åt för att finnas för 10 minuter. But don't do it any longer than 10 minutes. Men det gör det inte längre än 10 minuter. And then then you're to ask him this question. Sen ska du ställa den här frågan till honom. Pappa gör det här. Pappa gör det här. And when he says no. Och när han svarar ja. Then you are to answer good. Då ska du ju svara bra. Det är det här. Okay, they'll explain to you. And then you know that they know about the situation. De låter det bara få veta att de känner till situationen. Förstår du? And they want to tell you too. So they heard the press. De vill också berätta för att de har sina bröder. Förstår du? 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 Förstår det första han kommer att göra när han kommer över dit är att säga Ingen får tala om för mig vad jag ska göra. Förstår du? By the time you finish with Papa, you will have achieved sainthood. När du väl är färdig med Papa så kommer du ha uppnått helgon status. But spirit are around you and they help you. Men andevärlden finns i din närhet och de hjälper dig. I don't know if it's you or him. Someone has a scar on their stomach. Or we think on the other day and the home, and then all of them are at the market. Okay. They're talking about that. They don't talk about that. And I'm I'm to ask you how you like making the beds. Och vad vill jag ta fråga dig? Vad du tycker om att bädda sängarna? This is their way again of of um, letting you know they're close. Det är en gång bara det jag har sett att hoppa dig på veta att de finns i närheten. Sen kommer det att bli en dag här nu som säger att hon är en oväntad besökare. Och det här är ditt mormor. Det är en gång bara som säger att hon är en oväntad besökare. Det är en gång bara det jag har sett att hon är en oväntad besökare. Och hon ger mig nu en trygghet och sätter vis när hon kommer nära. Det är en gång bara det jag har sett att hon är en oväntad besökare. Hon hade många underbara tjänster den här dagen. And she just didn't communicate with her mouth, she communicated with feelings too. <coughs> I'm still your mama, she said. She said, I'm like your second mama. She tells me that she's got the finest collection of wardrobe in Sweden. She <coughs> told Of course, she wants to know why you never throw anything away. Hon vill veta att du aldrig stänger bort någonting. Förstår du? Ja. Så 
So if you want to have a lock of everybody, take a telephone number. Om du vill ha lock, vi ställer alla här, då kan vi ta hennes telefonnummer. Mm. Mormor's fine too. Mormor är också bra. Okay. But there will be time for you to pick up your passport again and travel. Men det kommer finnas tid för dig också att ta passet och åka ut och resa. With your camera. Med din kamera. Okay. So when you're in Australia. Så när du befinner dig i Australien. Send me a postcard. Skicka ett vikort till mig. Sure. Okay. From Sydney. Från Sydney. I would like to have one of you, a photograph of you. Standing outside of the Sydney Opera House. Jag skulle gärna vilja ha en fotografi av dig där du står utanför Opera Huset i Sydney. I'm not joking. Jag ska jag inte. Förstår du? I'm not joking. Jag ska jag inte. Jag ska inte. Jag ska inte. Du kommer att skicka det i kortet. Mormor sen så långt. Mormor hälsar så gott med kärlek. And if Papa doesn't be high, you can always gag him too. Om Papa är ut för sig så kan du alltid sätta munkabel på honom. But they mean that in a nice way. Men de menar det på ett snällt sätt. It's a bit of a hard period, but it will be okay. They come at what are an a bit too period, but they come at the okay. They've been trying to find his battery, so you could take his battery out, but they haven't been able to find it. So I've tried to find his battery, but I can't get it, but I'm not able to get it. Oops. The love for mom. The share of the mom. And father. Oh, father. But which one of them? One of them had farms. En av dem hade jordbruk en gård. Det finns en historia med landet och kaffan. Jag känner mig från att få ut. Så jag vill att man försvinner snabbt. He's been checking me out all day. I'm not sure. I think I'm the lady in the white sitting in the second row. I think I'm the lady in the white sitting in the second row. I don't need to be a medium, but I can see by your face. Would you have known the biological father? Who am I to be the biologist father? To say yes or no. Say by God and then. Ha! No information. No. No. What happens when she says to you? Nu har man konstigt att säga till dig. Okej, du blir adoptiv så har du blivit adoptiv på svenska. Ja, du har ju bevisningen att du har adopterat som svenska. Och vad är det? Kan du minnas din morfar på svenska? Kommer du ihåg din svenska, eller din morfar, din morfar? Jag har honom här. Och vad är det för en vacker man? Vilken vacker man. He's in the workshop at the moment, fixing the wrong man, fixing this and fixing that. He's in the workshop just now, fixing the grass, clipping and the one and the other. He told me he loves fixing things. He loves to fix something. Then he tells me you have a dream. He will tell me that you have a dream. And now it sounds absolutely crazy. Det här låter nu helt galet. But it could be possible that one day you trap somebody from your biological family. Men det skulle kunna vara möjligt att du en dag lyckas spåra någon från din biologiska familj. För sure. mm. Because he tells me this is your dream. Kan jag berätta att det här är din dröm? Kom så. You'll have to do some checking. Du kommer att få mig att kolla upp en del saker. Take a long time. But if you do it with your heart, then I'm sure they may get that. More far is going to help you. So come and more far help me. Because you become, you tell me, you become 
And next time the bird flies into your window. Och nästa gång fåglen flyger in genom ditt fönster. That bird was a message from spirit. Den frågan var en budbärare från andra världen. From Morphan. From Morphan. So, so you had two dreams. Du har två drömmar. Become a reader. Att bli med dig. And go and find your past. Och att finna ditt förflytta. Och att ställa det här. Och att ställa det här. Och att ställa det här. Jag var en ny utfattare som var kvar. Min talar kom till mig i en dag. Och jag hade ingenstans att veta heller vad jag hade gjort. Men jag följde rösten i drömmen. Jag fick aldrig träffa min far igen, men jag fick reda på allt om honom. Förstår du? Och om jag var sjuk, om jag kom till dig, om jag var sjuk, om jag kom till dig, så skulle du bara behöva röra dig med dina fingertoppar. Förstår du? So Inget av det här är utbildning. Så tolka tårarna. Och sluta klaga. Sluta klaga. Fixa klockan i köket, för det funkar inte som det ska. And when you're cooking, you get fish, don't slam everything down and knock it like that. And stop talking to yourself, they might come and take you away. <laughs> Because I give you these words. Your life is worth everything. And I never want to hear you use words again. My life is, my life is meaningless. De vill aldrig mer höra dig använda de här orden i sin liv är meningslöst. Förstår du? Kan du se det som kan? Kom till mig någon gång. Men då kommer jag vara skäten, inte du. Jag behöver inga råd. Jag söker inte efter en mamma. Förstår du? Jag har inte råd med att vara med mig. Jag har inte råd med att vara med mig. En kärlek från andra världen. En kärlek från morfar. Här måste lämna oss nu och han ska fixa gräsklippar. Om han blir riktigt irriterad så kommer han att lämna oss nu och han ska fixa gräsklippar. Han ska lämna oss nu och han ska fixa gräsklippar. Han ska lämna oss nu och han ska fixa gräsklippar. Han ska lämna oss nu och han ska fixa gräsklippar. Han ska lämna oss nu och han ska fixa gräsklippar. Han ska lämna oss nu och han ska fixa gräsklippar. Men när det blir det okända på tv? Kan du förstå det? Du behöver köpa en ny säng också. Förstår du det? Det är en kolla det kolla där. But you will find out about the soul. You come back for it and go on in time. Okay. I haven't been drinking. I promise you. Never want to drink again. That's it. Jag tar en skit bort nu. Jag tittar på mannen här nu, men jag är inte säker på om jag ska till honom. Han skickar ut en skit bort och kommer inte till mig än sen. Jag tror det. Jag tror det. Jag tror det. Jag är inte säker på det jag ska handla med en eller som annan bakom dig. Jag är inte säker på det här. Jag är inte säker på det här. Jag är inte säker på det här. Jag är inte säker på det här.